Hello and welcome to this MAMP Pro screencast. This is an introductory screencast for MAMP and MAMP Pro. Uh, I'm going to be using Mavericks and I'm going to be on MAMP 3.05. I've already installed MAMP and MAMP Pro on my computer. It's a basic install. And I'm briefly uh, going to go over some of the features. Uh, we have an installation screencast that demonstrates uh, how to install MAMP, MAMP Pro, both uh on a different screencast so what does map stand for map stands for mac apache mysql and php map installs these different servers and interpreters and allows you to run them easily uh, through a user interface why do i need map uh, maps can allow you to develop dynamic data-driven websites locally on your own mac uh, you can develop websites using popular content management systems such as WordPress, Drupal, and Joomla, uh, which use um, databases extensively. Uh, with MAMP installed in your Mac, you can write your own server-side code, such as PHP scripts. You, can, uh, you may have already developed websites using, using um, uh, basic websites using HTML, some JavaScript. Uh, using Dreamweaver or Coda, you can still use these applications right alongside MAMP and MAMP Pro. So um, briefly, briefly again, uh, if you want to develop code using a content management system, if you want to code some PHP, Python, or other server-side code, uh, if you don't want to spend time configuring Apache, MySQL, and just want to get down to coding your website, then MAMP or MAMP Pro is what you're looking for. Okay, I'm briefly going to go over MAMP. As you can see, MAMP has a uh, simple interface. Um, I got my two servers up here, Apache and MySQL. Uh, I can easily start them with one press of the button, green lights indicating they're running. Uh, over here on the left, I have a few preferences. I have my uh, some start and stop preferences uh, when I uh, want the servers to start and stop. Uh, I can set my ports for my Apache, Nginx, or MySQL. PHP, I can uh, I have two different uh, versions of PHP I can choose between, uh, some different caching options. And I can also set uh, whether I want the Apache uh, server running or Nginx. Nginx is a little more specialized web server. Most of you will be using Apache. And I have uh, my MAMP start page, which is going to allow me to um, uh, look at my uh, database via PHP my admin, easily look at my databases. This is already uh, PHP my admin's already installed, so you can easily look at your databases. Um, you can look at PHP info, uh, which is also very valuable to get some information on uh, the version of PHP you have. And I already went ahead and set up in my localhost directory a uh, um, WordPress site. And if you go to localhost colon uh, 8888, which is your uh, default man port, um, you will get to your local host, which I've already set up. Yours is going to be empty. If you type this in, you'll get an error because you don't have anything there yet. But once you put uh, uh, some files in there, a uh, website, running website, uh, you will have it working. And that's about it for MAP. Okay, now I'm going to go over briefly MAP Pro. As you can see, Map Pro has got quite a few more features to it uh, through the user interface. Uh, it's broken down into seven different tabs, and uh, I'm briefly going to go over uh, some of the main features in Map Pro. Um, in the general tab here, you can uh, change your MySQL uh, and Apache ports. Uh, you can um, there's a few start and stop features, self-explanatory. 
Um, the main difference here between MAMP and MAMP Pro is you can change your uh, users that are launching Apache and MySQL. You can use the www and MySQL uh, users to launch Apache and MySQL. They are a little more secure. In the hosts uh, tab, you can see I can set up several different hosts. Um, you can set up as many hosts as you want. Um, uh, here in the general settings, you uh, you can see here you can set up zip.io and once you do that, you can um, quickly, if you type this into your, uh, on, on the same uh, network, uh, if you type this in via a mobile device, an iPhone, iPad, tablet, uh, you can quickly check your sites, how your sites look on a mobile device. Um, extended features here, many features you can add right through the interface uh, to configure your Apache server. Secure sites, no problem through the inter user interface. You can set those up. Extras, uh, as you can see here, you can uh, quickly install a content management system right through um, the MAMP user interface and have everything set up. Uh, modules, these are, are Apache modules. You can add and uh, delete modules as needed uh, from your Apache setup. PHP, we have quite a few different uh, or five different versions uh, come uh, installed with MAMP Pro. You can, uh, through the website, download more versions. Here's a big one, module CHP, P, module PHP versus CGI PHP with the CGI PHP, you can have multiple versions on a per host basis uh, for your host, which is great. You can quickly switch between hosts and have different PHP versions uh, running on them. Uh, here we have the, um, you can activate the active X debug. Um, we have this, uh, we have the, um, free MacGDBP debugger installed with MAMP, so you can debug your PHP code. In MySQL, um, we have, uh, in addition to PHP admin, there we have SQL Pro and MySQL Workbench. These are great tools for um, uh, configuring or, or, or viewing your databases and changing them. Um, here we have a few options to allow network access for MySQL. Some of you may need that. Uh, DIN DNS, um, you can, some options here to allow, uh, to use your Mac as a live server. And Postfix for testing your emails. Um, also we have the, similar to MAMP, we have the web start button which is going to take you to your map home page and it's going to allow you um at least for some reason you don't want to delay here oh there we go um p allow, allow you quick access to php info uh php my admin and uh, some links uh to and some information about your setup so that's a brief overview of map pro and each of these tabs, uh, we're going to have separate screencasts for each tab and go into detail about what you can do. So the, this is going to be seven different screencasts uh, if you want more uh, information on these different tabs. So that's going to do it for an introduction to MAMP and MAMP Pro.